All right, guys, the title is true. I have scoured the internet. I have tracked down four impossible logo quizzes. Also, they say, but here's the thing. I've got a secret weapon. You see, something that a lot of people don't know about me is I actually have a real life job. Yeah, I know. YouTube, they're not giving me a penny these days. Seriously, actually, if you could subscribe, I'd appreciate it a lot. Thanks for coming and watching this. I actually seriously appreciate it. I'm grinding hard at the moment. They're not paying me a single thing. So I got a real job. I'm a designer. I run a clothes brand with my wife. We run a cafe and a clothes brand. And so I've been in the design world for quite some time now. Logos are not foreign to me. So we're gonna take on these four expert level challenges and we're gonna crush every single one of them. Play along and see how you'd go against me. Let's do it. All right, only a logo expert can score seven out of 10 on this color quiz. All right, so straight up, we've got Starbucks here. We've got four colors now. I, we barely even have Starbucks in Australia here, but I am almost certain, I mean, I know it's green and I'm almost certain it's this top left one here. Yeah, FedEx, okay. Uh, this is a bit of an easy one. This is a slow ball right here. I don't know what these colors are from, but FedEx is absolutely orange and purple. Ikea, I mean, surely these are gonna get harder, right? Ikea is like iconic Swedish colors of blue and yellow. Google, okay, okay. This is gonna get a little bit trickier now. Okay, let's have a quick look here. It's a bit tricky because I feel like if I could see the logo four times, it would be a lot easier, but I think Google is blue to start with and has the two reds. Oh, this has the two reds as well. I'm gonna go this one. Yes, that was, that was definitely the hardest one yet. By 10 times harder than the one before. Pepsi, I mean, again, no one. No one's not getting that. Uh, Microsoft, okay, interesting again, very tricky. Um, I feel pretty strongly that this one's correct here. It just looks right looking at it. Yeah, I mean, it's just this one, right? Yeah, you can just tell. I think you can just tell. Okay, Coca-Cola, this is interesting because we have clearly, you know, everyone knows Coke is red. It's probably the most recognizable brand in the world. Uh, but yeah, we've got four shades of red. Now, is it the brightest red of the three? Is it the kind of the most vibrant of the three? Yeah, it is. No, it's not. All right, well, we lost one. Okay, Amazon, interesting. I feel like it's probably this. This feels way too washed out here. It's gotta be this one, right? Yep. Red Bull, okay. This one's interesting. I'm thinking top left. That's too dark, that's too bright. It's probably one of these two. I think it's gonna be this one, yep. Nice. These are these are like the BuzzFeed kind of logo things. They are the brightest of all of them. Uh, nine out of 10. That's pretty good. All right, the hardest fast food logo quiz you'll ever, ever take, which is the correct Domino's logo. That is absolutely this one here. That is just insanity. No one's ever clicking on that, which is the correct Burger King logo. I mean, even more crazy to think that that could be correct. That is, those colors look disgusting. Uh, which is the correct McDonald's logo. I mean, again, I mean, this is correct. If they say this, they're just wrong. Okay, good. Which is the correct Starbucks logo. Okay, now I have to be honest. These are like, oh, okay. We have the star on the hat. Okay, I don't think there's a star. I don't think there's a star. There is a star. I'll be honest. There's no Starbucks within about two hours of my house, but that's okay. Correct Subway logo. Uh, I think it's gonna be this one, right? Yes, nice. Which is the correct Wendy's logo. This is where things are gonna get a bit tricky because we just don't have any of those in Australia at all. Uh, I will say blue feels better, but I don't, yeah, I mean, I'm kind of getting lucky here. Dunkin' Donuts are in a similar situation, uh, but again, these things are on like TV enough that I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it's kind of in the brain anyway, you know, like it is, it's available to me there. The information is available. Now Dairy Queen, I have, I don't even know what this is. Like, I don't know if this is fast food, no idea. Um, if I was designing this logo, I would definitely be doing this one. This feels weird. So there you go. They made a good choice. Which is the correct Pizza Hut logo. Um, again, I don't know this. This is a different logo to what we would have here. But to put the little swirl up there is not correct. This is the correct way to have it. So I feel pretty good about that as well. Okay, which is the correct Chick-fil-A logo. Okay, what have we got here? What's the difference? There's this little gap here. We don't have these in Australia, but from a design point of view, this is definitely better. So yeah, cool. All right, nine out of 10. That's pretty good. You know, I'm pretty happy with that, especially like half of them we don't even kind of have where I live. So I'm, I'm super happy with that. All right, can you score 14 out of 18 on this ultimate fashion logo quiz? Let's find out. Uh, Levi's is, ooh, I, I initially I thought this straight away. 
And then I saw this and thought, maybe. I have to go with my gut here. Okay. Whoo, that was a scary start. Uh, whose logo is this? It is, I was going to say, it's not either of those two. It is Chanel, Coco Chanel. Which of these is the real Rolex logo? Uh, yeah, it's this one here with the kind of nice equal, what do you call those, prongs on the crown? Yep. Uh, whose logo is this? Uh, guess, Hollister, American Eagle. Uh, it's, okay, so it's not Guess, it's definitely not Armani. I think it's Hollister. I actually don't really know what this brand is. I don't think it's American Eagle either. Which of these is the real North Face logo? Okay, uh, it's this one here. It's got the kind of uneven rainbow. Nice, stoked on that. Whose logo is this? This is Ralph Lauren Polo. Yes. Uh, which of these is the real Tommy Hilfiger logo? Okay, that's tricky. I'll say straight up, I don't know. This, I'm actually gonna go this one. Yeah, that was just the vibe one, that one. That just feels better. When I look at it, I just think it feels more correct. This logo is this. This is Comme de Garçon. Yeah, very good. Which one is this? the real Adidas logo? That looks disgusting. That No one thinks it's the opposite. It's this one here. What logo is this? Uh, well, it's not Reebok, and I don't think it's Nordica either. I don't know what these two are. Um, looking at the... This looks like kind of like a sale kind of thing. Aeropostale. I don't know what that is. If this is correct, this is good brand. It is Nordica. You know what? I said sale and Nordica is like a definitely like sailing based. Um, I don't know why I didn't think of that. I just didn't. I just thought I'd recognize the Nordica logo, but definitely wrong on that. Which of these is the real Hermes logo? Um, good question. I guess the bloke's out of the hook. I think it's this guy out of outside the horse. Yeah. Uh, whose logo is this? I don't think it's Fendi. I don't. I know it's not Tiffany. So it's one of these two. Tom Ford. What's that all about? Mm, let's go to this Tory. I don't know what this is to be honest. So I guess it's just got to be that one. Which of these is the real Timberland logo? Uh, it's this with the open top. That's nice. Uh, whose logo is this? Again, these ones. I don't. I don't recognize a lot of these. Uh, Valentino Dockers. Mm, okay. This is all I'll say is, I don't recognize this at all, and I don't know what Dockers is, but if we've got ourselves an anchor here, Dockers kind of makes sense, we'll take it. Which of these is the real Lacoste logo? Okay, what's the difference? The arrows point the wrong way. I feel like this one makes more sense to me. Wrong, they go back. I guess that does make more sense from the actual animal itself. Whose logo is this? Uh, again, I don't, I don't recognize this at all. Okay, I don't think it's juicy, I don't think it's this. Uh, let's go, this. this feels fancy again. If this is this, Westwood with this kind of wreath kind of style feels good. Red Perry, cool. Never heard of it. I don't feel bad for not getting that at all. Which of these is the real Versace logo? Again, what's the, this one looks better, but I don't even know what the difference is. I legitimately cannot see the difference between these two. Is there just more detail in the hair? Yeah, there is. Yeah, cool. Uh, okay, what is this one? Burberry, Balenciaga, Balmain, Bulgari. Okay, uh, it's not Balenciaga. I can't, off my head right now, I can't think of what Burberry's logo is. Like obviously they've got their iconic kind of tartan style uh let's go balmain on this i don't know it is burberry interesting okay we've got 14 out of 18 i did feel like we were going to do better than that but hey it's a win a win's a win there was a few where i hadn't even really seen the logo before so that makes it a lot harder this quiz puts the f from other logos onto the facebook logo to see if you can still identify it all right a pretty easy start and a funny one as well this is the fanta f very iconic and it does look funny on the facebook logo like that yeah there it is there Okay, uh, looking at it, I don't know what it is until I come over here. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, Foot Locker, yeah, it is the Foot Locker F. Very good. Yeah, there it is. Uh, I'm going to try and guess these without looking, um, but f straight away, I actually don't know at all. Um, and we do fall into the issue here where I don't actually know what any of these brands are besides Ford, and it's not Ford. So let's try, let's try Folgers. Fritos, cool. I don't know what that is. Okay, it's like Lay's chips, sweet. Okay, F, this one is the Ferrari logo. Yep, very good. Uh, this F feels really familiar, but I don't recognize it at all. Uh, Funyuns, Fruit Loops, no. Frosted Flakes, don't think so. It's not the Facebook logo, so I guess it's Funyuns. Uh, what are they? More chips, cool. Ah, uh, this is the Firestone. Yep, the tire brand, Firestone. Uh, this F here, hmm. Don't recognize it straight away. Let's have a look here, Fila. Don't think so. FIFA, don't think so. Fruit of the Loom, don't think so. Fujifilm, probably. FIFA, interesting. Yeah, actually, yeah. Uh, okay, big fancy one here. I feel like this one is Ford. Yeah. Uh, it's funny seeing it without the rest of the logo there. I oh, know, this is the Fila one. Yeah. 
that's pretty iconic right there yeah i mean seven out of nine i'm pretty happy with that well there you go i mean like i said it went well it went well how did you go let me know in the comments below hey if you're having a good time why don't you subscribe there's a thing right here otherwise watch another video we're out here having a good time appreciate you guys thanks for watching this far actually crazy if you made it this far appreciate you so much i'll see you in the next video